Setting up NBN Wireless is easy. Before you get started, you'll need four things. A message from us advising that your NBN service is active, your NBN modem, an NBN wireless antenna installed on your roof or gutter, and an NBN connection box installed in your home. If your home has been connected to the NBN before, there may already be NBN equipment installed at your premises. If not, we'll arrange for a technician to come and install it. First things first, find your NBN connection box. This is commonly installed near any existing phone sockets you may have. Make sure that the power cable for your connection box is connected to an electrical outlet. Next, it's time to plug in your NBN modem. The WAN port on your modem needs to be connected to the UniD1 port on your NBN connection box. Next, use your modem's power cable to connect the power port to an electrical outlet. Finally, make sure the electrical outlets for both devices are switched on and press the modem's power button to turn it on. Allow 15 minutes for your modem to boot up and configure automatically. Once you're done, check the lights on your connection box. If the ODU light is red, you may need a different UniD port. Try connecting your modem's WAN port to the UniD 2, 3 and 4 ports, waiting a while after each port to see if the ODU light turns green. Once the ODU and status lights are green, you can start connecting your devices and get online. You can use additional Ethernet cables to connect devices to any of the four yellow LAN ports. Our NBN plans include an NBN phone line. If you'd like to use it, you'll need to plug a handset into your modem's Phone 1 port. Otherwise, you can just connect devices via Wi-Fi. You'll find the Wi-Fi name and password on your modem's barcode sticker. That's all there is to it. If you have any trouble getting online, give us a call and we'll be happy to help.